this uh, another time I'm making a video about this putter <laughs> because I didn't click upload. So I'm an idiot or publish or whatever it is. Uh, anyway, <sighs> this is um, what I was saying I'd get rid of if anything is this line here on the top of the putter. Uh, I would, uh, and it's only because it's not straight. Um, I guess I'd have to get get rid of that paint, get somebody to wipe that out for me. Uh, overall, I just pay attention to the face now anyway. It's not that big of a deal. But if you're not lining up your putts to this line, do so. If you have one and it's straight, get one of those mark lines or whatever it's called, little plastic thing for your ball at Walmart. Seven bucks, definitely worth it. Just uh, go ahead and throw that on there draw a line on your ball, line it up to this line, or use a marking that's already pre-stamped on your ball. Anyway, uh, very little offset, love that, definitely love that. It's not like the normal huge bend that's in them, which I used to have that kind of comes down and kicks back and goes down. But yeah, I definitely get rid of that line. It's not that big of a deal, but it's something to distract me that isn't straight. Just a, it is a, to me, it's just a great looking putter. Um, another thing about it is this, and this is very important. This is the way that your hand attached to your grip, all your grips should feel great to you, and your putter grip especially, because you have the softest grip on it. So you're going to be, it's a big feel thing. The putter is so much feel. Uh, and if you haven't taken a look at this grip yet, do so. Don't feel like you're being a tiger nut. I mean, the guy knows what he's doing. Definitely take a look at it. If it works for you, use it. Uh, again, little details. That is just so friggin' cute, isn't it? That's fucking awesome looking little guy. There, it's a ping blackout grip. Uh, smaller than normal grip. It's gonna put your fingers and wrists into play a little bit more. Keep them steady, you know. That's I mean, obviously some people like to go with a huge grip, so it shuts those out. But just learn to shut them out on your own and use the smallness for feel in your fingers. It, it, besides just the great feel of the putter head and a great feel overall putting, such a baby smooth feel. Uh, it really is. It feels like velvet. Um, and then this I thought was real neat too. Old school ping symbol. Such a cool little symbol. I wonder why they ever changed it. It's so neat. Why? I mean, I know they they didn't really change it. it you know, I just wish I saw that on more of their stuff somewhere. Uh, so that's real neat. I think anyway. So yeah, that's about that. Um, this in here without banging it. Uh, ended up putting some of these back on. I left these in the car because those are the ones I normally take with me. When I practice, uh, yeah. Always necessary, especially in Florida. The sunshine state, or actually the rainy state, because it rains out of nowhere, is a good umbrella. And, uh, Got a little Nike symbol in the grip. I think that's neat. If you can see that. It's carved in there, whatever. Uh, and then... Let's see where it is. Yeah, let's see how dirty this thing is. Uh, that's that towel. I don't know if that got cut out of the one video, but that's the towel I was talking about. Little... little black towel, perfect for wiping off your clubs, doesn't get all stained, it's black, it's a nice little towel too, what's that, okay, this isn't, this is my, the gloves I use, uh, just the wet weather gloves, I always keep a pair of wet weather gloves in there, that's two of them left in, right, they're just straight black, a little Nike symbol on them. Whether they are, better they work. 
I don't have a caddy to always attend to making sure my towel is dry to dry my hands, so that's that. And here is my glove. So this one's actually brand new. I have a beat up beater one in the car that I use for practice. Dry fit tour. Um, I'll make a video about gloves. I, c I could just throw it in this one. I got some time to burn anyway. Um, I normally use uh, Titleist gloves. Uh, I don't know, actually, I'd rather make a video just based on gloves. So this is the glove I'm using right now for summer. Because of the dry fit, really helps a ton, especially in Florida. Your hands sweat ridiculously um, other things that are in here is like uh, I think what this is getting stuck on in this pocket is just a bunch of uh, oh I didn't show you what golf ball I used um, a bunch of the little course cards for uh, the PGA around here like uh, we have PGA out at St. Lucie West and uh there's a like three different courses there made by Pete Dye. These are the balls that I'm using at the moment. Uh, I got a good deal um, on a bunch of practice balls. They're brand new, but you know they got sent to uh, this guy's buddy, you know from from Nike, because he's uh, I guess he's like the club pro or whatever, and he you know they they he's sponsored by them so. They send them a bunch of practice balls. It's it's these balls, but they just say practice on them. And I started using these balls. Or buying, I bought one box of my own just to check it out. This because, like I said, I hit the ball too high, and that'll get my ball flight down there. The old Nike one blacks. I really like the way they look. And uh, that's just. I think that's really neat. Let me focus in so you even know what the hell I'm talking about. That's so cool looking. I they made the next ones and this is just all black. I I don't like that. And then they came out with the ones now that are red. I have a box of those that I haven't tried yet. Supposedly, they they have a new outside of them. I need to cut my nails. Uh, outside of them, uh, power something. When I hit them, I'll let you know about them. But there's the line I was telling you about, and it says practice right there. <laughs> I have a cursor I'm pointing with the cursor like you can see that. It'll probably cut out after this but I'll just keep talking in case it doesn't. That's the line I was talking about. Nike One Black Practice. Well they're just Nike One Blacks but they had practice on them, marked on them. You got like a huge bag of them. It's a great ball. It really is. Uh, I think it bores into the wind a little bit more than a Pro V1X. And, uh, yeah. And then, let's see what else I got here. It's tease. Uh, let's see, my ball marker, if I can get to it. I actually use a North Carolina uh, quarter for. ball marker and uh, I use this as a divot tool that's my divot tool and that's my North Carolina quarter it's got the little cowboy thing carved in the back you should be able to see that oh excuse me um but yeah, Carolina Quarter. I like it. Numerous reasons. Jordan played college there. Uh, like North Carolina Blue, and uh, the Quarter. You can't such a bad picture. You guys know what the North Carolina Quarter looks like. It's got the first flight thing on it with the the old airplane. I like that for numerous reasons. I do not know what year this is. 2001. Yeah, that's a good picture, but now it's going to cut all this out. <laughs>